Kong is uh, trying to call skunk, or what they call flower. Oh, last time he was just running circles around the bale feeder. Oh, that's why the other calves are over here now. So we're just about out of uh, first cut. This, there's only three bales after this one here. And then there's a couple green feed bales and a couple second cut bales. But uh, the pasture's starting to come up pretty decent. So these guys will be out rather quickly. What you doing there, Cream? Huh? Yeah. Push this bale over. This is the one bad thing about these heavy duty bale feeders. Is the cows, they're able to eat the hay back far enough and it won't fall back over so you gotta kind of pay attention to them so I actually I like the tombstones because you put it on there coke bottle style and as they eat the hay away the coke bottle basically keeps unwinding and unwinding and then they're able to get at it the square feeder here uh, because of how it's designed it's a hay saver type how it's designed, uh, it can sit in this V pocket, and uh, and then the bale isn't able to fall over. So there's very little on the bottom. Like there's only like two feet on the bottom because they've chewed it, but it's leaning on the back bar right here. And then there's I don't know four or five feet up top here. So anyways, I'll just push that over for them. But that is one thing I find with the hay savers. That you gotta uh, pay attention to is if they get the bale, if they get the bale pushed back like it is now, uh, they can eat away a pocket and it won't kind of keep falling down. I just gave them that other bale. I should have pushed this over with the tractor, but just get it here by hand. So there, I just pushed it over by hand. There's so little of the bottom left, it just kind of, once you get it over-centered, pretty much falls down itself so, there, so. They got tons of feed in the bottom of that feeder, too. They're just being fussy, because they're able to. Got to go check socks. She still hasn't calved. So I don't know if she's open. Still got a bit of a bag on her, but I think the other calves are licking off her too because there's nothing going on back here. In fact, it looked more swelled up the other day, so still got a fairly beefy side on her, though. So I don't know, she's still got uh, 12 days or so. But uh, I checked my notes last year and it said uh, it took her over two weeks to swell, uh, blah, blah, blah. So like I say, that back end looks more swollen the other day. So I don't know. She might, she might be open. I'll find out, I guess, a couple more weeks. Go we'll check these guys. Threw him some second cut alfalfa so we can get the tractor in here, throw him a new bale. And the calves are starting to eat the second cut, so that's good. Ta Natasha's herding them. Now they're going to go check out the bale that we just threw in here. So, Anyways, we're probably going to jump on the bikes and go check the pasture. Kind of 
And here's the uh, heifers. So there's midnight. Is that midnight? There's that one. Oh, that's Skywalker. There's Firefly, Cookie. Then midnight looks the same as Skywalker. The only way I tell is uh, the ear tag. Two yeah. side by side, you can barely tell you apart. Can, you can tell midnight's face because it's like flat. Yeah, she's got a little bit flatter face, but if they got their head in the bale, you can't really tell. So they got a bale a couple days ago. Number one, he's called P. <laughs> Number one, so I put a float on the water here for him. One thing I found different was I usually use the cast aluminum ones and they're fitted for MPT or when you jam pipe thread in there with Teflon tape it accepts it anyways. Mm -hmm. This plastic one is for a garden hose and uh, I put MPT in here and it started leaking really bad so I had to pull it out, pipe dope it and then I put this uh, hose clamp on it to tighten it and it's it stopped leaking for now but uh, where I buy the floats at at the feed store they didn't have uh, the metal ones they just had the plastic ones and I didn't think there's any difference except the plastic housing so but there is it clearly says right on the top here attach a three-quarter inch garden hose well, nobody around here uses a three-quarter inch garden hose. We all use half-inch garden hose. This is three-quarter poly pipe, but it's uh, got a hose barb to MPT and then national pipe uh, down into it. So this is uh, this is midnight. Is this midnight? Well, that's Skywalker. No, it doesn't have a tag in its ear, right? Or does she? Oh, this is. No, oh, I can't tell the difference. Right, Skywalker's got her RFID tag ripped out. Well, anyways, she looks the same as Skywalker.